Yo, it's Bonnie Godiva, you already know. 914 stand up. Listen, nowadays everybody's a fucking critic. Always wanna talk and discuss it when they don't live it. Tell me who you are to be judging the way I'm living. Trying to front like it's a fact when it's nothing but your opinion. Yeah, I got a couple sins. Did you die for them? Living with a few regrets? Have you cried? All the way out to BK. Um, Queen of the Ring, King of the Dot, all that good shit. I'm over here with STM Radio. Shout out STM Radio. I'm about to do this Power 2 car for this weekend. It's my first time in Detroit. I'm mad hype. Dope ass card. Shout out to Quest McCody. Shout out to the league. Um, let's get into these predictions. Oh, before I do get into the predictions, actually, shout out to Light Clothing. Um, go follow them on Instagram, Likes Clothing Company. Fuck the system. Fuck with them. So, you know, fuck the system. Um, let's get into these predictions, though. So we got Mr. Mills versus Stack Almighty. Um, I'm going to be honest, y'all know I keep it real. I don't really know who Stack Almighty is. Um, I haven't watched some of his shit yet. So I know that Mr. Mills is really dope. I've seen him on RBE. I've seen him on a couple other stages. You know, dope pen, always has nice punchlines. So I'm sure they would give him a worthy opponent. So, you know, I'm leaning towards Mr. Mills, of course, because that's who I've watched before. But, it's you know, hopefully it's a good battle. Um, the next one is Shadi P versus Tycoon Tax. Um, Shadi P, I've only watched one of his battles. Um, it was dope though, so you know he he get off. Um, Tycoon Tax, I've seen him a couple times out, you know, on King of the Dot. Um, I'm expecting Tax to take it, just based off what I've seen. I could be wrong. Um, but I got it, Tax. You know, with that battle, M City versus Excel. Um, M City has. A really dope pen, and he's always been, like, one of my, as far as pen, personal favorite. Um, I sound like smacking shit, my personal favorite, but not like that. Not that type of personal favorite, but um, as far as pen, he's dope. So, um, XL has been on this shit, too. He's kind of fell off a little bit here and there, um, you know, but that happens. Um, I'm expecting City to take it 2-1, though. Um, it could be a body if XL don't come prepared. But I don't expect it to be a body if they both come prepared. I'ma say I'ma say City two one. Um, Magic versus Mac Myron. Um, I think this is gonna be a dope battle. I always loved Magic. He's in my top five heavy punchlines. You know, I am a, a punchline rapper, so of course I like what B Magic does. Um, you know, as far as style and how he writes and sets up his punches and things like that, he's always been in my top five. So. Um, I think it's going to be a dope battle. Mac Myron is dope. It's his stomping ground. Um, it should be a good little classic. Um, Mac is definitely the underdog, but he's at home. So it could go. I'm, I'm expecting Magic to take it, but it's not going to be a body. Um, Midwest Miles versus Head Ice. Um, Head Ice, you know, the OG. I think it's definitely somebody I want to see battle more because he started, you know, he started a, a real long time ago. Was mad dope, always funny, charismatic, charismatic when you meet him, you know? That's just, that's ice. So, um, I want to see how he does. He did really good with Sirius Jones. I enjoyed that battle. Um, and then um, Midwest Miles, that's his stomping ground. He he really has some dope battles under his belt, too. He has a good resume. So, I'm going to go with Ice. I'm going to go with Ice 2-1. Um, let's go to the next one. Mar vs. Rex. Y'all know I've never been a Rex fan. Um, and not to sound like a hater, but to spit some real facts, he has been off his game. As of lately, it seems like he's been more, you know, making taking the money moves and not really caring about the quality of the rounds that he's given out, which I think is unsuitable, you know, for somebody asking the type of price he asked for. You should be given that quality of work. So I haven't really been rocking with Rex, you know, anymore, even battle-wise. Because he hasn't been on his shit. So I hope that he comes on his shit. Because Marv is nice. Um, he, he got punches. You know, he's at home. Don't sleep on the nigga. Because you might really end up getting fucking bodied. Um, but if they both come on their shit. I don't know. If they both come on their shit, it could go either way, honestly. It could go 2-1 either way. But I hope, you know, Rex come on his shit. Um, math versus Quest McCody. Um... That's extra sound, not sound like a hater on this. Um, <laughs> uh, math last battle was chilla. It was dope. Um, 
Quest McCody, I seen the two on two with Hitman and um Verb, him and Quest, him and uh Marv. I think it's gonna be funny because Math battle Marv. So I think you know Quest might do some some funny shit. Like I don't know, come back as a nigga ghost or some shit, and Marv ghost and body the nigga, some shit like that. Like I don't know, it's gonna be dope. I think it's definitely gonna be a classic battle. Um, we'll see, we'll see how it go. It could go either way. Um, and then. Calico versus Ill Will. We got as the as the last battle, main event of the night. Um, this is gonna be dope. I always like Ill Will. He's not very punch, you know, punch punchline heavy, but he does have heavy punchlines every now and then. I always admired his freestyling skills, so he's always been somebody that's circulated around my top ten at least. Um Calico just put on a good classic with Tay Rock at Summer Madness. So, based on last performances, I probably would say Calico 2-1. Um, but we're going to see. We're going to see how it goes. If it will come on his shit, he could take the battle. But I, I'm leaning towards um, Calico 2-1 right now. So, that's it. Shout out to the Power 2 card. It's going to be dope. It's going to be, we're going to have fun at this event. Shout out to Ash Cash. I'm going to be chilling out there with my girl for the weekend. And, you know, shout out to Power 2. We about to be out here in Detroit. We showing that love. STM Radio. Gold digger, nigga.